over the next five minutes, we're going to explain everything you need to know about the film genre science fiction, everything from aliens to the apocalypse. Here is just some of the things we're going to talk about over the next few minutes. The first science fiction feature films appeared in the 1920s showing increasing doubts about the destructive effects of technology gone mad. One of the greatest and most innovative films ever made was a silent film set in the year 2000. German director Fritz Lang's classic Metropolis, made in 1927 in Germany. As we've already seen in some of the previous clips, one of the characteristics of the sci-fi genre is the future. The majority of the time, the future looks grim. Humans are low down in society in a post-apocalyptic world. Which leads me perfectly onto our next convention. In a lot of sci-fi films, particularly in futuristic sci-fi films, technology has advanced a lot, from the weapons they use to robots and cyborgs. There are fields. Everybody recognises this convention as sci-fi because of the otherworldly elements to it. Travellers from another world visit Earth often to destroy it. This characteristic falls into every other convention. Something more advanced and more powerful than mankind must destroy the whole of humankind for the Most sci-fi characters are heroes trying to save the Earth, or themselves. Around 11, 11, 30. The Alderaan system. Use it. Science fiction music has a lot of similarities to horror music. It is often dark, mysterious and eerie. in this movie. Big themes that make you think, but then... The most well-known director who has made a lot of sci-fi films is Steven Spielberg, who was recently voted the best director of all time. George Lucas also stays close to the sci-fi genre. I should have realized our destiny was never to stop Judgment Day. It was merely to survive it. Together. The Terminator knew. He tried to tell us. But I didn't want to hear it. Maybe the future has been... There's no fate but what we make for ourselves. <laughs> 